America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. With just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Well, worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. Muy buenas tardes, espero que estéis todos muy pero muy bien, bienvenidos un día más a mi canal, bienvenidos a Red Dead Redemption 2. Vamos a seguir a Lenny. Lenny, así mismo se llama el negro de, de los Simpsons, ¿no? A ver. Ahí está nuestro caballito, el suyo parece una burra y el nuestro pedazo de caballo. Venga, te seguimos. Sígueme y te sigo, papi. Para la rumba que nos vamos. No, 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 I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Mrs. Adler? Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrifying. But I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state of Lemoyne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a, a glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west is... Out west is out west. And you're all who you are. Right. Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge different. Oh, hell no. Guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shiny. And their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay, then. Plus... It beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Hold on now. Are you Me gusta el tipo de conversaciones que llegan a tener, eh? Down old plantation house. Down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons. We're gonna wanna strategize a little before getting shot at. Of course. They said find the old battlefield and keep on going. Yeah, I've been here before. I can see the wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? You see that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. Vale, ahí hay unos huesos. Hear that? Someone's on the track. Vale, un segundito. Look there. The wagon. Let's see where he's going. You're on me now. Right behind you. Let's keep our distance. 
Just two fellers out on the road. Are we following this guy or what? ¿La dibujamos o qué? ¿Qué es esto? Has fallado, has perdido el carro. ¿Qué carro? ¿Qué es lo que me he perdido? Ah, vale, vale, vale. Vale, vale, vale. Vale, vamos Lenny, vamos a hacerlo. La mira de precisión. Vale, ahí está. Just a moment. When you've had a look, tell me what to do. You ain't seen anything? Espera, ¿de qué objetos? Shooting the ceiling? Can you look again for me? I know dynamite crates when I see them. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot, then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for a performance. Just give the word. Vale, Lenny, enviar a Lenny disparar la dinamita. Enviar a Lenny. Going in, kid. Give them both barrels of charm. Wouldn't try anything less. Vamos, Lenny, tú puedes. Qué grande, Lenny. ¿Ya le están mirando? Today is a fine and fabulous day. As all days, and so may it be. Praise be, my people. What do you want? Praise be, my people. Praise be. Now, I come in peace to discuss the merit of glory and interest you in eternity. Praise be, my people. Come on, kid. Now, are you, have you, will you be saved, my brother? Praise be. Praise be. I want you out of here now, boy. Praise be, my people. Praise be. I said, get out of here. Uh, praise be. Or a, a, a great miracle shall strike you down, my family. Get out of here, you darky. I said, a miracle shall strike you down. Damn it. That'll stay.
well done something to get out. Sounds like a plan. Let's search these wagons, okay? You got anything? Not yet. Okay. Vamos para adentro. Perdona, tenía un mensaje importante ahí. A ver. Vale, 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 que sí que te entiendo. Pero qué hacemos, a ver, a ver. Subamos. Ya, ahora sí. Eso es. A ver. ¿Alguna cosa más? ¿Y aquí dentro podemos entrar? No hay nada, o sea, de verdad. Esperaba que esta casa fuera full. Vale, nada. Pues vamos a la parte de arriba, revisamos y luego nos vamos. Nada. Nada interesante, de verdad. Por aquí tampoco. Pues nada, no nos queda otra que irnos. Por aquí nada. Pues nada, esa era la misión. Vámonos. Arre. Sí, sí, a buena, a buena hora. Nos estás metiendo prisas. Si no ha venido nadie hasta ahora... Acabo de llamar a mi caballo para que me siga. Y a ver dónde acabamos. Vamos a coger la línea recta. Vamos, vamos. Ah, 
have sworn someone else would have shown up by now. It don't matter when they show up, as long as we're ready for them. Yeah, well, I'm looking out. Leonard, Leonard, Leonard. I'm looking, all right? I can't see anyone chasing us. I should think we're out of the woods then, so to speak. <laughs> boy, oh boy. <laughs> you did good. We did it. Well, let's get to camp before saying anything like that. I know Sean's been bringing in quite a lot lately, and I wanted to... <sighs> it's good to have something to show like this. Sean's a loudmouth bragging. Don't worry about what Sean does. Hey, I like him, you know? Well, so do I. It's my better judgment. Just... You worry about you. We don't want to tip it out here. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But... No, but enough. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts, we know what you do for this gang. We notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. Camps in these trees up here. Let's get there. Arthur, Lenny, coming back. These are fine rifles. Right? I'm gonna keep one, just for me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> you know how to fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. Perfecto. Y cuando nos hemos desembolsado. Se puede saber. Caja del campamento, no está mal. A ver cuánta pasta tenemos nosotros. Mucho. Vale, aquí en el campamento hay algo más que hacer. Sí, a la B. Vale. Y luego... Vale, nada más. Pues vamos a la vez. Arthur, we need to talk to you. Even Arthur. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense and. I don't know. I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Well, hit the goddamn bank with us. <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy. But I ain't gonna lie to you, there will be law if we linger. And if we're serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> All right, I suppose it's worth taking a look at least. We should wait until the morning. In any case, I need to change out of these rags if I'm going to be performing. Okay. So, Bill, 
It's better be worth it. Oh, it is. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. All right. Let's go. Mr. Morgan. Herr Strauss? That man. The debtor, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. Dead? Huh. Well, no, he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can. Head up there and collect. We lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. What's the plan, then? Oh, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. All right. Follow me. Yeah. Perdón en un segundo, sigo teniendo los cascos, pero me fui un segundo. Vale, Bill, vamos, Bill. Que sí, que sí. Dale. Que os voy a adelantar ahora. Vamos a atracar un banco. If we can get in all right, we'll send Miss Jones ahead to the bank. They won't recognize her. I'll show you boys how it's done. What are you thinking this time? I don't know. Fellers always like the lost little girl, but nobody plays a drunken harlot boy like me. Nita should work. Once she's got them distracted, we'll move in. When I was scouting the place the other day, there was only a couple of guards. We deal with them and any customers who are feeling brave. And you always fancy yourself as the vault man, right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought me. Hey, I'm more than willing. Nah, best I do it. Oh, and did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. What kind of deals? See, you don't realize, Morgan. I'm out there putting in the work same as you. I've been drinking with them a couple times now. Seems they're looking for some extra security. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Could be something in it for us. Well, just be smart about it. We got a lot of irons in that fire right now. Yes, I know, Morgan. Got me going back to Valentine. Don't tell me it ain't hurt you leaving that bank behind. Not really. Work a town and not hit the bank? <laughs> That's downright pathetic. I guess we went a bit beyond working it. We shot the place to hell. You did, Morgan. Not me. I played it cool up there. Couple of punch-ups. Dealt with some old Driscolls. Ah, oh, is that right? Like I said, you mess up, it's just one of them things. I mess up. I'm the prize idiot. Well, Bill, I don't know what to tell you. Surprised you ain't already ripped me about that dynamite again. One mistake, and I'll never live it down. What do you need? A pat on the back? A medal? Just know I got the lead on this one. We'll see about that once things get going. Oh. So, thinking this through, you rob Cornwall's train, we shoot a heap of his men in Valentine, we rob his stagecoach. This is just dawning on you now. And now, we're going back to the one place he knew where to find us. That's the genius of it. Folk never look at what's right under their nose. I ain't sure that's always true. What's happened to you? You're getting real nervy in your old age. The last few weeks happened. Forget about Cornwall. He can't have many men left at this point. Got a bit hairy in that barn, but we all walked away fine from that. Didn't walk away with much. If 
four of us could deal with them in Valentine, and four of us could deal with them after the coach robbery, I ain't too worried. If you say so. We need to move quick once we're in Valentine. I'm sure they ain't forgotten us. Of course! In and out! Dutch is gonna love this. Let's get it done first. Allá vamos. ¿Es eso Valentine? Sí, esa es la estación de tren. Ostras. A ver si hay otro caballo, si entramos ahí y compramos. Ahora ya que tenemos más dinerillo. Vaya tensión, ¿eh? Okay. Keep it cool and follow me, fellas. Vale, hay modificaciones en la ciudad, qué guapo. We never decided. Is it lost little girl you want or the drunk in Harlem? Vale, a ver. Eh, chica des desvalida o fulana? So which one? Desvalida. Uh, I think I'd like to see the little girl lost. So even you long to save the fallen women, eh, Arthur? You break my heart. <laughs> you really do. <laughs> if you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. We got this. Okay, we're going. No, hold on. Wait till she's gone real down. Vale, vamos a ver qué, qué significa robar un banco. Vale. Vamos. 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 Son of a bitch, hurry up. Come on. Okay. Vaya, en menor presión estamos metiendo. Oh, 
Vale. Vale. Forzar las cajas por ti. Vale. Vale. Perfecto. A ver, ¿cuánta pasta podemos sacar? Vale, vale, vale. Esto sí es robar un banco. Esto sí es robar un banco. Vale, saqueamos. Vale. Vale, hay otra aquí. Vale. Nos queda un poquito. Vale. Vale, 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 vale. Ahí lo tenemos. Vale. Saqueamos. A ver cuánto hay aquí. Vale. Vale, esta y nos falta una caja más. A ver cuánto sacamos de esta. Menos pastizal, eh. Uh. La de dinero que nos vamos a llevar, ¿eh? Vale, ya lo tenemos. Ahí está, está. Ahí está. Vale, cogemos a ver cuánto. La de pasta. La de pasta que nos llevamos. No sé, pero nos van a venir como 3-4 millones seguro. Vale, aquí no ha pasado nada. Yo me voy por aquí. Yo no estaba con ellos.
cómo mola la música, eh. Qué tensión, eh. Thank you, Bill. We're alive and we're paid. Yeah. I don't see the problem. Yeah, and that is the problem. <laughs> Bill, <laughs> this you. is a very good take. That you'll be happy, even if it did come with a heap of trouble. Ah, it was fun. <laughs> well, maybe you're right. Now, go on, get out of here. I have some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp and make sure you ain't followed. Vale, a ver cuánta pasta nos hemos desglosado. Cuatro millones o así. ¿Cómo? ¿Por qué no tengo la pasta? Ah, vale, porque está regresando al campamento, creo. Ostras, ostras. Vale, hay que bajar por ahí. Vale. A ver, a nuestro caballito ya tiene hambre, hay que darle algo de comer. Eh, eso... Algo... Esto, una manzana. Allá vamos. Hay que ver cómo corre la resistencia que tiene. Vale. My husband's not cold in the ground and you've come back here, Archie. I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now, I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. He didn't have a choice. He was good and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you've as good as killed him yourself, and don't kid yourself. You had a choice. You speak as if killing was something I cared about. You ever wonder about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Mrs. Downs. 
Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. No respect for the lacks of you. Well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. You best stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. I'll have to take your word on that. Good day. Jolín, es que es duro, ¿eh? A ver dónde se regresa Arthur. Y con lo del dinero del banco no sé qué ha pasado al final. Solo para el campamento. Vale, madre mía, 20 millones, mi parte es dos, dos y pico solo. Bueno, está bien, pero, pero me esperaba más. Vale, baja, baja. Vamos a hacer la, la caja fuerte. Ahora voy contigo. Luego. Libro de cuentas. Arthur, Arthur, Arthur. Oye, Arthur aporta muchísimo. Sí. Arthur está pa pagando casi todo, eso no es justo. A ver, ¿qué objetos tenemos? A ver, damos el lingote de oro. A ver, ¿qué cosas queremos mejorar? Dar objeto. Vara de oro. Vale, hemos donado una vara de oro. ¿eh? Una vara de oro. Y ahora vemos... Eh... No, 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 no. Contribuir no. Ya es suficiente. Eh, marcharse. Hemos dado nuestro diezmo. Eh, libro de cuentas. Vale. Siguiente. Eh, la medicina no... Provisiones no, munición no, amaro para los caballos, herramientas para trabajar el cuero, una barca del campamento. Lo de los caballos. Has desbloqueado la armadura para acabar para el campamento. Tanto para que vuelva al campamento, accede con rapidez a los caballos que tengas estimulados. Vale. Guay. Vale, perfecto. Perfecto. Y a por Maika. A ver cómo estamos de esta mina y de todo. Vamos a ver si comemos algo por aquí. Oh, Arthur, it is good to see you. You okay, maybe? Just great, but I nearly got killed back in town. They caught me robbing from a store and I ran for my life. You weren't followed here. Morgan, of course not. Who do you think you're speaking to? Good girl. Vale. Pues vamos ya con Maika. 
Maka? You all right? Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called... Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes. I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. The O'Driscolls. I mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the O'Driscoll boys on the road in the town. And things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? <laughs> like a corner tight. Thanks, sir. <laughs> anyway, now somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things. Like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Yeah. Comb O'Driscoll. <clears throat> Have you lost your minds? Always telling us, Dutch. Do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably a trap. But what do we got to lose finding out? Get shot. We ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. It's a chance. Gotta take. I killed Combs' brother. Long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Vale, allá vamos. Fine. Mount up then, Morgan. Let's go then. Allá vamos. Pero también te digo una cosa. ¿Qué cosita es? Quiero cambiar mi caballo. No es porque no me guste sombra, pero quiero el más potente del juego. Vale, un segundito, me gusta. I've been fighting Cone for so long now. I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes. Doubting Thomas. Is there any plan you ain't sour on? Well, maybe you're right. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. What did you say? We had Pinkertons coming after us. Because of Blackwater. And Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then it, it, who knows when this look. Cool hillbilly thing will come to a head. Hmm? And we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts, and O'Driscoll. There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but like I said, I'm nervous. Look, you ain't even going to be the one in danger. We'll get on over there, find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Then me and Dutch walk right in to the lion's den with you to cover us hmm? okay just keep calm unless i give you a reason not to oh we'll be fine we got you i will do my best oh my dear and trusted friend with you watching over me i would walk into hell itself as would i Hey, up there, men on the ridge. Oh, Driscoll's from the look of them. 
I don't like having eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Ugh. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that could have been safer. I just... I see all those mouths we gotta feed, and I... I dream too big. Caring too much. That's my problem. Caring too much? There's no such thing. This is horse shit from both of you. It might be. Micah might be full of shit. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Men created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. All I ask is you try. All right, cowpoke. You're gonna peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Hmm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, is it? Charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. Whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. You always loved the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? Oh my. Ostras, Pedrin. I don't know. Column's got a sense. <laughs> Handing them over to the law. It's, I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. With this fella Column's right, we can draw them all back. True. Where'd Column and Patrick head off to? In it. He's escaping and shoot him! Relax. Relax. I got him. I got him. <laughs> Did I kill you? Oh, not yet. <laughs> no, of course not. Not yet. But I will. Oh my god.
Finally. Put his weapons over there. Duck preach true. Let me go, Cone, and end all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't the forgetting sort. If I were you, I'd run as soon as I had the money. <laughs> oh, I know you would. Let's see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you, grab all of you, and hand you in, then disappear. So you only met with him to grab me? Of course. He's gonna be so mad, he gonna come raging over here. And a whole lot of you. And the law will be waiting for him. Oh, Arthur. <laughs> Arthur, I missed you. Vaya destrozo, señor. Pobre Arturo. ¿eh? No me esperaba que, que acabara así. De momento. Eran peores tiempos, ¿eh? sin duda. Estoy destrozado. Es
Holy. Vale. What? Where I am now? No. ¿Por qué? Ah, vale, vale. Pobrecito. Swanson! He's gonna set the law on us! No, of course he was! I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, you're safe now! Oh, let's get him to bed! You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. I got you. You're safe now. That's pretty, it does. That's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. Whew. I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Well, not quite yet, River. <laughs> Good. How you feeling? Oh, uh, about the same as you. <clears throat> I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. You too. Pobre Morgan, eh? Allá vamos. Vamos a arreglarnos un poquitito. Vale. Recortamos el pelo. Vale, de momento lo dejamos así. Pelo engominado. Recortáramos también un poco. Vale. Pobre Arturo. Vale, vamos allá a ver a dónde tenemos que ir ahora. Venga, no hemos salido en tanto tiempo, vamos a ver qué nos espera.
Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job, needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what if they're bored in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, uh, that's so? Yeah. They think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these gray boys a bit now. This is on the level. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud, but instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying the Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told you. Oh my. Ostras, me han matado. Me han matado. He ido muy a pecho descubierto a ver qué pasaba. Y no se puede ir así. Ah, toma por eso. Is you. 
You want us to come out? We'll come out! Yeah. Oh, Bill! Guns on the ground, now! Both of you! Don't do it! You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Chef! I'll blow his brains out! You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? How the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. And you can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. Micah? Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. Uff. Durillo, eh? Y ahora qué? Esa es la pregunta. Y ahora qué? First like church. Like an little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. Qué pena. Vamos a ver a Dutch. A ver un segundo a ver dónde nos ha dejado. Vale, estamos cerca. De hecho iba a decir que me suena a todos estos recorridos. O sea, no he estado como por aquí, creo, pero el ambiente es muy similar. Bueno, a lo mejor sí he estado, pero... ¿Qué es lo que pasa aquí? Have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, uh, where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him, we will bring him back to you, and we will kill any fool that had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head. Abigail. You have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right now. Dutch! We just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you, let's ride. Okay, let's go get that boy back. They must have figured out what we was up to, Dutch. Yeah, we just got shot to hell by the Greys in town. I know, I heard about Sean too. I don't want to even think about that right now. We have to focus on Jack. I swear, I'll kill everyone there. Easy, John. Try to stay calm. Huh? Did they get to him? I don't know. But we are getting him back and they will pay. I promise you that. What about the gold? Who gives a damn about the gold? They got Jack. I hate to break it to you, but 
I don't think there is any gold. Or if there is, it's hidden somewhere no one knows. What? I've turned every stone. Christ's sake, Hosea! After all that, another perfect scale. We underestimated them. No, they underestimated us. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. So come on! Should have stayed out of all of this. Bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Come on, let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. Qué guapo, tío. Parece una película. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. John, I need you to stay calm. Los magníficos ocho, eh? Increíble. Get down here now, you inbred trash! What the hell do you want? The juego es increíble. Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged or otherwise, that is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. If you ain't gonna be civilized about this...
you find another way? Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for 120 years. We never had no problem except for Where Yankees. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son. Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Where is the boy? You filth. All right. We get her out of here. Uh, uh, what about down? Now <laughs> 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 oh, let's get this hag outside. Any more of her sons to deal with? No. <laughs> Reckon they're all dead. <laughs> That's right. Burn this dog to the ground. <laughs> You boys sure Jack in here. We searched everywhere, Dutch. You got that one, Arthur? I guess that's the end of the goddamn cribbage here. You take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite. You stole Boys my Boys are off pickle. limits. You stole my horses. Ain't no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My sons gave him to Angelo Bronte. So my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on! What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. <laughs> it's gonna work out, John. Gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, um, she, she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at this logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. What do you think, Arthur? My boy will be fine, but... Well, of course Marston scared rotten. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble <laughs> for nothing. No, no, not for nothing. For living. Now, we get that boy back, and we go. Trust me. Hey, Dutch, we got a problem. Not a problem. Visitors, a solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderlind. Mr. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan. Nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're aware, but this... This is a civilized land now. 
We didn't kill all them savages only to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man, so in love with greed, he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off disappear and go and live like human beings someplace else. You came for me? Risk life and limb in this den of lowlifes and murderers so that they might live and love? Well, ain't that fine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case, it'd be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake, all of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. Run away from this place, you fools. Run. Come on. Get your damn hands off of me, boy. What now? We get out of here. And quick. Any ideas? I know a big old house. Hidden in the swamps outside Saint Denis. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. The place is well hidden. You and Arthur, right out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you get packing! Otra vez a marcharse. This is crazy. We'll get packed up, but we need a spot. Follow me. I know the way. It's gonna be all right, John. We should be going for Jack. We will. But we have to move everyone first before that bastard Milton comes back with an army. Hold on. Let me get you. Jack in jail, or at the end of a rope. I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this.
That's it up ahead. Four walls and a roof. We're moving up in the world. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. You sure this place is empty? I ain't sure on nothing. All right. Let's leave the horses here and take a look. Oh, shit! It's them again! Boys! Still some here. Ah. Let's see that. You want some more of them? I'll check the house. You keep watch out here. Any more of you upstairs? I'm coming for you! You hear me? Who the hell do you think you are? You fools should have left when you had the chance! Where are you creeps hiding? Come out where I can shoot you! Oh, I'm gonna be real happy to shut you up. I knew you'd come. Soon enough. You are some other coward. Like you. The bounty hunters. The freedmen. The carpetbaggers. The army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. Our fight will live on. Jesus. To shoot the last one. Good. Come help me with this, will you? We good? You search the whole place? Give me a hand moving these bodies. Don't want the others walking into this. <clears throat> Follow me. All right, this way. We'll dump the bodies in the swamp over there. You go meet up with the caravan. Guide them in. Esta tarea quizás es algo repetitiva, pero también hace como que te metas dentro de la historia. No sé si estoy defendiendo bien el juego o, o qué, pero... Vale, van a venir unos caimanes. Vale, ya vinieron todos. Welcome home, all you, to uh, my humble abode. We got fine living. Ignore the corpses and the alligators, it's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Come on. Dodge? Yes. Could I have a word with you? <coughs> Not now. ¿A dónde vamos? Can you believe that girl? All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. 
Everything okay with you two? I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. So, where are we going? To take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world, San Denis, I keep hearing about. According to the map, the road up this way should lead us right in there. All right. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Everything went okay? A few loose ends. Nothing major. And John? About what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We are going to get that boy back, whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Subtly, of course. Public places, maybe start with the saloons. Un segundito, vamos a ver de progreso cuánto llevamos. 38 38 5% al 32%. Put some ocean between us and all of this. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a long time, I truly believed a paradise lay somewhere in the West for us. But I just don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Whatever we do, We'll need more money. Okay, there she is. A real city. The future. Ostras. Big cities. They're always repellent. Exactly. I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. Yes. Vale, aquí acaba un capítulo más de nuestra bonita historia. Capítulo 4, Saint Denis. Vale, estamos libres en Saint Denis. ¿Qué es esto? Establo. Hay establo, hay mil cosas, ¿no? Y no podemos ir a nada todavía. Es otro juego ahora mismo, ¿eh? Líneas de tren y todo. Vale, arriba, caballito, arriba. Los placeres de la civilización. Stick them up, cowboy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So, here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? 
I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. And from what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I'll meet you back here in on. Ya la he liado. Ya la he liado. Venga, diálogo, Arthur. Arthur, tío. Diálogo. Pues Arthur, ¿sabes lo que dice Arthur? Que color incolorado hasta que he llegado el capítulo de hoy. Un placer, señores. Dale un like y nos vemos en el próximo vídeo. Hasta luego.